First, ensure the MIDI engine plugin is installed and active. Then, use the import button in the content browser to select a MIDI file from disk. The plugin will import your MIDI file as a UMIDI asset. If you open the UMIDI asset you should see a list of instrument tracks from the MIDI file. Each track will contain its respective MIDI notes. This organization makes it easier to access and work with the MIDI file. Let's see how to access MIDI notes or MIDI events in a sample blueprint. Create a variable of type, UMIDI asset, in the blueprint. You can then set your imported MIDI file as the default variable. MIDI Engine provides helper functions in both Blueprints and C++ to help you access MIDI tracks and MIDI notes. In this example, we are getting the piano track by name. This will give us access to all the MIDI notes in the piano track. MIDI notes contain information like the start time, which represents its note on event or the time that MIDI note starts playing. They also contain the note ID or note name, like C5, A1, etc. That's how simple it is. From here, you can build your own MIDI player. Alternatively, we provide an add-on that will help you play back MIDI with quartz or meta sounds. If you want to animate objects synced to MIDI files, you can get the sequencer add-on for the plugin.